son of a biscuit eater, I am dead. You are about to enter the Chrome Dome. Alrighty, Chrome Domers, welcome back. I'm Old Bald Guy, aka OBG, and we have stepped into it this week. Oh my goodness. Week three of GAC up here in, or well, down here, I guess more appropriately, in Carbonite 1. And look at this. What the heck? So we are a massive 1.443 million GP now. And we felt kind of lonely. Not going to lie. There's a lot of people not anywhere near us. Uh, I mean, the second lowest in the in in the, in the group is 2.1, and I mean, come on, man, that's still 700 above us. Uh, there's a two eights here. Our opponent, our first week opponent, is the highest GP in the group at 4.6. This guy has literally in the past six matches only given up more than 10 banners one time. One time. He has some. Out defense. He has 97 Zetas, more than everybody else. He has 135 Relic levels with 14 Relic 5s, 31 total Relic units. He has 17.5 average speed in his top 25 mods. That's nuts. Eight of them at plus 20, at 20 plus, 22 at plus 15. Holy cow, is this a roster. So... Uh, he only has the single Omicron. It is on Qui-Gon Jinn. I hope we don't run into it, but goodness gracious, are we in for it this week? This could be our first 0-3. I'm not going to lie. If these guys show up, I don't know what happens here. I honestly don't. So, hey, look at that. Rank 1 in fleet. Still holding on. It's been an hour. There we go. All right. So... As you can see, we are still 77 points above the cutoff for Carbonite 1. I'm not super worried about not making it out of Carbonite this season. But let's let's pull this up, okay? Let's just let's just pull this up here and take a look at this. So, we have uh yeah. So this is a relic 7 Rex and fives, I assume. Relic seven and Rex with Relic three, uh, Shaq, Relic, Relic seven, fives. And I'm sure he has, they have all the Zetas that they need. Yeah, he's got fully maxed out. So if we kill anybody except fives, he's going to pass that all along to him. Um, he is running Cody over here, which would be an easy kill, but whatever, that's not going to matter. Um, so, I mean, one option is we come in here, we try to outspeed them, kill Cody, kill uh, Echo here, and get fives to sacrifice, and then we come back in uh, with a second group. That's one option. But the problem is Shaq over here is going to be so fast. 234. And and then she's gonna and she gives speed up to everybody like her leader ability. Clone trooper allies have plus thirty five speed, and she is not one of those. But still, plus thirty five speed on top of these guys, they'll be super fast. And with Rex's offense up, that would be hard. And then our other option down here on the bottom is a freaking Relic Seven Han and Relic Seven CLS. We know how much trouble these guys gave us last week. So, I mean, you got a farm boy Luke over here. It's whatever. So, I I think we have to go... I, you know, I don't know. I feel like our best chance to score any clears is going to be to throw everything we have at Shaq and try to bust through there by doing multiple attacks. I don't think we can bust through... These guys. I just don't feel like we can. The the counters from uh, CLS are too strong at Relic 7. He's got a lot of healing, a lot of things going on. I don't think that's going to be a good plan. So we're going to go up here. And we're going to come in with Vader. Because our Vader is, I believe, faster than 
than anybody he's got. So the fastest guy he has here, Rex is... Oh, crap! Rex is 258 plus 35 puts him at 293. Um, and Shaq is a Jedi. Yes, okay. So that means that our Vader... He was 283 or 290, 258, 280, 293. Our Vader is 246 plus a whole bunch, so he's well over 300. So Vader would go first. And hopefully I can trigger the sacrifice early, get the turn meter train going, keep get Rex ability blocked, and go from there. All right, so that's the plan. This is a horrible, horrible match. I mean, how do we get in these situations? My goodness gracious. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. Oh, whoa, you went first? That I thought it was faster than he was. Son of a biscuit eater. I am dead. So dead. All right, so let's go ahead. We can't even go anywhere but there. That's whatever it is. That's fine. Toss those out too. Boom. And I'm dead. Okay. And. All right. We're, Echo is our target here. Come on, get a turn. Vader gets a turn. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What do we do here? I think. Let's not risk this. Let's go here. And we're going to come over here. Cody first. Boom. Echo. Boom. I'm going to save you for later, Shaq. That was not very hard. Holy crap, that was not much. Uh, yeah. All right, yeah, we expect that. Now we need to take Echo down. All right, come on. Yeah, here we go. All right, we have achieved that thing that we wanted to happen. Let's go here. All right, that's fine. Do that and that and that. And another massacre. Here we go. All right, let's go over here first. They're going to hit me back pretty hard. If I can get Shaq down, that would be really good. Uh, let's do this here, because I don't want to take that Counter-Strike. Oh, Shaq's out of there. That's what we need. All right, we got a shot here, guys. Not going to lie. There's a shot. There's a chance that we get through these guys here. I mean, I don't know we're going to win, but there's a chance that we hold up here. There's no way we win this in one shot, right? All right. Uh, that is not going to do anything, so go in hard there. Okay. That's all right, though. We got three of them dead, which is huge. We got rid of Shaq and Fives. And Rex is almost dead. So we can get through this now. Now, how do we get through it? Bounty hunters? Bounty hunters. Where you at, guys? Come here. You're way at the bottom down here. Bounty hunters. Let's go. Okay, that's fine. Yep, that hurts. That sucked, but that's fine. Uh, throw those out. Yep. Uh, go ahead and pop up the taunt so we can do that and get the frenzy. Let's do boom, 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 boom. Nice. And add that on there. And let's start shooting the weakest here. Looking good, guys. And we're going to take Echo down right in now. All right. 36 banners. We almost got through it on the first shot. But, hey, we cleared it. I am not going to complain. That was... Relic 3, Relic 7, Relic 7, Relic 1. That was nuts. All right, let's see if we can clear this back row here. Okay, I think we can work with this. This is a beatable team. All right, we're going to come in with Sunfac and Filter Droid and Hyena Bomber. And I'm just bringing those guys. So I don't think we're going to win this on a banner th banner fight. A banner trade, a banner out bannering them, but I'm not going to mess around and give away banners. I don't need to. I don't need Geonosian Soldiers ship in this situation. Um, all right, we're going to start. We have Spy and Soldier. Let's uh, let's hit Spy first because he has a bad news. 
and let's go ahead and get rid of that speed down go ahead and give everybody a shot and there goes spy doing his thing and he's dead all right now let's go over here we got everybody oh there goes darth maul nice and almost got soldier down we're going to get a reinforcement though which is going to be sunfac with an auto auto stun and let's go ahead and bring in spy and we're going to snipe off soldier and stun sunfac and we'll burn through him real quick and get this territory clear nice 69 banners from that so I doubt very seriously that he's going to struggle with Qui-Gon Jinn Omicron over here. But if just in case he does, you know, hey, who knows? Weirder things have happened. All right, so <laughs> we're going to try this. But the odds of this getting anywhere useful is virtually none. All right, so we're going to come in. Do we soften them up? So we have CLS... Geonosh, uh, Grievous Droids, and Padme. Um, they do a lot of attacking. I turn some, some. Well, they do more counterattacks than anything else. Um, let's go with Geonosian. Let's go with the Grievous and see if we can weaken these guys a little bit. Maybe we'll take out a couple. I don't think this is going to go very far, though. All right. So you made him bad, and you're going to come across and do that and be super sad. And Han is definitely who we want to go away, but ability... Oh, gosh! That was painful! Holy gajeebies. Let's go straight in with Han. All right, we got a stun on Han. That's fine. And we're going to keep working. Oh, gosh, that was so much damage. All right, Han's stunned again. I go down, and down goes. Yeah, the only thing I can do is that, so I'll just shoot him, and I'm dead. Okay, did not make it far. Not going to lie. Wasn't really expected to make it far, but that was really bad. Um, I mean, we are so outclassed here that our chances of winning this basically rely on him choosing not to be a, a, a fighter, which did happen in his last two fights. So it's a possibility. That kind of thing can still happen. Thanks, dude. I appreciate that. Just, just running through us with no, no respect. I get no respect. All right, burn him. And R2's gone. And hit him hard. Okay, well, that's going to be it for today, folks. That was the butt-kicking we were expecting. Um, but we did clear the Shakti clones, uh, which is a really, really tough team, even though they went first. Uh, we got some little bit of luck there. Cleared two zones. 420 is a pretty solid... You know, it, it is it is 420, and, and that's a solid score for 420, so I'm not going to complain. Um, so let's go uh, see what he does. And we'll be back in uh, two days with an update on round two. Till next time, OVG out.